Hi, it's Demon Destroyer here, but I do now have a new name, so I am known as Big Cat. So, um, today in the video, I'm going to do a little description about the Minecraft 1.12. But also, I'll be describing about why I have changed my name from Demon to Big Cat. And I will tell you the reason for that, and I would also tell you the reason why I haven't been doing many videos recently. Now, Minecraft 1.12 is come is and to come out in the next sort of month. So I decided to do a little video describing about what Minecraft 1.12 includes. So the first thing that I would like to know is what on earth save toolbars is. Now saving a toolbar is basically where you get to save your toolbar whatever's in your eventually. So if you die on creative it will save it for you and when you die it will just pop back into your eventually. Which I think is quite a cool little idea, but I'm afraid it doesn't work on survival. Not unless you upload the sheets and go into creative and get your toolbar back. Which is shooting people, so don't do it. So, this is... I'm standing inside my new house, and it's not made of anything from 1.12. So the first thing I want to describe is what these blocks are. Now, concrete blocks are things that I've always explained that make a pretty cool house. As you can see, they are interlocking so you cannot see within them. So this is a quartz block, and this is about going to be a con white concrete block. Where is white concrete? So this is white concrete versus quartz. So this is a regular quartz block right here. As you can see, there is a gap in within them. If you look on white concrete, a lot smarter and a lot more shinier. This could be the next generation of modern houses in Minecraft. As you can see, with the white concrete block, it looks a bit greyer, but hopefully it should look a little bit shinier. It, it's because of the sun's reflection shining on it. So that's the first bit of 1.12. You can also see that this, the miscellaneous button, or icon, used to be up here. Now it's moved down here, so it's leaving space for the save two bars thing. So if you look in miscellaneous, we have one new animal. Now this animal has been described as the one of the only tamed flying animals in Minecraft. And you, you all know that bats are actually the used to be the only flying actually flying animal in Minecraft. As you can see, they will fly up and just generally annoy. But this one is a new one. The one that you can the only one that you can actually tame. And this is the parrot. Now the parrot has one special feature. And this special feature is um is going to be lucky enough. This special feature is going to be lucky because this feature has noises. So the parrot with squawk had two times the amount of hearing as a normal Minecraft player. So when it hears monsters, it will squawk at you saying that there is a monster nearby. Otherwise, it will squawk at any, any form of mob that seems dangerous to it. So, the, one of the, the only way you could possibly tame a parrot is with cookies. And that is a good thing because they only originate in the jungle bio. And there's a lot of cocoa beans there and it does seem to be quite a bit of weed. So that is one advantage of taming a parrot. So, to tame a parrot you just... So this parrot is now tamed and it now has no name. And one of the special features is that if you walk up to it, it will pop onto your shoulder. Now, you are only allowed a maximum of two parrots, one parrot on each shoulder. So, if I tame another parrot, it will go onto my shoulder. As the bats can't be tamed, I'm afraid. Sorry about that guys, but I wish with the bats you could tame pretty much any animal. So that's the next feature within the Minecraft. And I don't think there's any more features that is on there here at the moment. 
But what I do know is that something is coming to Minecraft. Now don't be alarmed about this, but I am not going to say what it is. So what I want you to do is comment on this video, um, just under just under this video, and comment what you think the most special thing that will be coming to Minecraft 1.12, and not as a snapshot. Now I know what it is because I've been watching a lot of YouTube videos about this special creature. So I will be hearing the comments come through, and I'm hoping that you guys like this video of the description of Minecraft 1.12. But now I am off to explain why I've not been doing Minecraft videos.